All right, so uh, one of the projects that I made with Sam was to make a clone of the game Simon. Uh, this was a game uh, from the 80s that I used to play when I was little. And um, here's, so basically it does a pattern of lights and sound and you have to match it. Let's see how I can do. Oh, gosh. oh, I messed up. Um, so uh, the only real bummer with this is the way that the capacitive um, things are configured here. With yellow, um, only A1 is possible uh, to hit. Now, with an adult's fingers, you're probably going to hit it, so you're fine. But, um, you know, V out, um, AO, ground, those um, don't actually work. Uh, for this game. I'm sorry that it keeps going a little fuzzy. <laughs> Maybe if I... All right. So anyway, for all the other ones, um, there's enough pads available, which is really nice. Do you want to try, Scarlet? Yeah. Why don't you give it a shot? Go for it. All right, so, yellow. A1? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. No, no, no. The, the um, copper part. <laughs> It'll get you, especially when it starts repeating like that. So anyway, that's the game that I made with uh, Sam. We're about to erase the memory to do um, a one where Blinka jumps out of a box. So I want to make sure I record this.